Small and medium enterprises make up 90% of Nigeria's businesses. Notably, 40% of these enterprises owned by women are more profitable, underscoring their vital role as a backbone of the country's economy and driving economic growth. U.S. Consul General Will Stevens, speaking at the Women's Entrepreneurs Academy in Lagos, affirmed his government's commitment to supporting the continued growth and success of these women-owned businesses. He encouraged the entrepreneurs to foster connections and support one another. This is a program that the U.S. government sponsors together with local partners here to train women who want to start their businesses or who already have small businesses and help them get their businesses to grow and be ready for further investment. So it can be in businesses in everything from technology, agriculture, trade, investment, services, and we help them and they connect actually with mentors in the United States at a graduate school of business in Arizona, as well as with mentors in the pri private sector in the US and with each other. And they build this incredibly strong cohort, which you're seeing today, of women entrepreneurs across Nigeria who are investing in one another and growing their businesses and employing Nigerians. It's incredible, it's so inspiring to see these women tackling the tough problems of being entrepreneurs and, and looking to partner with the United States. Stevens encouraged the women entrepreneurs to embrace their roles as leaders, inspiring the next generation. He urged them to pay it forward by mentoring the next aspiring entrepreneur, bringing her into the network of the Academy of Women Entrepreneurs and teaching her the skills to succeed. Abisola Ayola and Adibisi Adileye, members of the Academy for Entrepreneurs, or Women Entrepreneurs rather, encourage fellow entrepreneurs to preserve or persevere through challenges. Being a part of AWE for the past five years has been an incredible one. It has helped my business to scale. The beautiful thing is that I got my first business grant. I learned how to pitch from AWE and I got my first business grant from the U.S. government in 2019. And since then, I've gone ahead to win the best beauty brand in Africa and also to represent Nigeria in some competitions. Um, as the president of the association, of the alumni association, Part of what we have done is that we kind of open access to markets. We've been able to exhibit in different um, African countries, as well as um, we've exhibited in Egypt, Kenya, Namibia, and um, the United States. Um, aside from that, um, we've also partnered and um, collaborated with different government agencies like LSCTF, Smedan, NEPC, She Trades, UNDP, and UN Women. My journey so far with AWE, um, learning. Learning how to be a better entrepreneur, learning how to better manage your funds, how to grow your business better, and most importantly is the community of women that I have been opportuned to get to work with. Um, from them you get to purchase stuff, they also get to purchase from you, and basically you just have a beautiful hub where we can all work together to grow each other's businesses. Tough times don't last, tough people do, like they always say, um, collaborate, always look to collaborate. With collaboration it helps helps relieve a lot of um, stress, um, it aids you financially as well. So look to collaborate with people in your community. Uh, also put an ear out just in Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.